So this, this hydraulic system and components will be used in a high capacity heavy duty mining and maintenance crane which will be used on, a, on an iron ore mine site to interchange high wear components. The hydraulic components in this system will be used to provide the lifting uh, functions for all those, those applications. First we have the prime mover which is the electric motor and hydraulic pump set. So the, this item provides the input power to the system which then uh, distributes the power to all actuators and functions. So we have a 250 kilowatt uh, high efficiency electric motor uh, rigidly connected to a 500 cc closed loop axial piston pump and a 250 cc open loop axial piston pump. So the, the main lifting or luffing function of the crane is performed by these two actuators which are fed from the, the prime mover. Uh, these have a 300 tonne capacity each uh, to provide the, the luffing motion of the crane. Back there we have the hydraulic power unit uh, enclosed housing uh, where the prime mover will be located uh, along with the hydraulic reservoir, uh, all um, control valving, filtration, sensing and, and telemetry. Access, maintainability and serviceability was a key project requirement, uh, which also presented a large design challenge to make something accessible and maintainable while still fitting in a very small overall space envelope with this type of equipment is, is extremely challenging. So we've still managed to make all the key uh, service items, filters, sensors, um, anything that requires regular maintenance or inspection to be very accessible for the operator, uh, whilst maintaining all the other elements of uh, making the main pump set removable, fitting in, in the overall space envelope. So this is the pressure unloading and pressure filtration uh, component for the open loop system that feeds the proportional valve bank. So this is a, has a large slip-in uh, ATOS unloading valve combined with a high pressure filter unit which protects the open loop system and provides the uh, safety unloading relieving function for, for the open loop system. The application for this power unit is for a large uh, industrial crane, jib crane. The main actuators on the crane are sophisticated piston motors and each of those piston motors have a, a case drain uh, which provides the the a passage for the, the internal leakage of the motor to return to tank and given the uh, value and complexity of those motors uh, each of the, the motor case drains is returned to the HPU and has inline uh, case drain flow monitoring which is a, provides a predictive real-time measure of wear and performance of winch motors and that way the, the end user can uh, actively monitor any um, changes to uh, performance in the system or predict any potential major failures on ex expensive uh, items, hydraulic items. So this area of the hydraulic reservoir features a suction isolation and strainer which has an inbuilt closing valve mechanism so we can uh, close this valve and change the inbuilt strainer element without the risk of the tank volume uh, displacing. It also has feedback uh, on valve position to ensure that the control system uh, knows not to start the pump when the valve is closed because that, that provides a risk of critical damage to the, to the very um, complex and expensive pump. If our suction valve is closed and we try and start, we'll create cavitation and damage to the pump. 